Hi, how are you? Good. Are you up the street? Okay. Oh, hey, there we are. Looks, oh, hold on a second. I gotta shut this all off. Shabbat shalom, everybody. Welcome to our service. Um, thrilled to have everybody online and a, a few of us in person here, which is wonderful to have as well. Uh, Jordan, it's been a while since you've done a Friday night, so we're really thrilled that you're going to do that. Uh, we'll have candle lighting later. As you could see, it's really quite in your face, so uh, yes. you, you, are the, you are the person gotcha. uh, and other things. So we're looking forward to it. Page one in our prayer books for the afternoon service. Page one with the ashray. Please rise as we will uh, begin the Amidah, page 3b, first two blessings, and then silent devotion, page 3b. Baruch Ata Adonai, Eloheinu Eloheinu Elohe Abraham, Elohe Yitzchak, Elohe Yaakov, Elohe Sarah, Elohe Rivka, Elohe Rachel, Elohe Leah, Ha'er Lagadol Lagibor Benara El Elyon, Gomel HaChasadim Tovim Mekonei HaKol, Bezocher Chastei Avot, Umevi Goel Ibn Ibn Ehem, Laman Shmo Bihabab, Melech Hozer Forkir Moshe Omagin, Baruch Ata Adonai, Magin Abraham Ufokid Sarab, Ata Gibor El Hamadonai, Mechayim Eitim Ata Rav Loshia, Mechaukil Chayim Bechesed, Mechayim Eitim Rachamim Rabim, So Mech Nofim Rofecholim Umatir Asurim, Mechayim Mamratoli Shinei Afar, Mechamocha Baal Giburot, Umidom Elach, Melech Miminum Chayab, Umatmiach Yeshua, Veneman Atalachayot Metim, Baruch Atadonai, Mechaye Hametim, Baruch Atadonai, Alakadosh.
Shalom aleinu v'yakho Yisrael Yahase shalom, Yahase shalom Shalom aleinu v'yakho Yisrael Yahase shalom, Yahase shalom Shalom aleinu v'yakho Yisrael Bimeru, Amen we continue with the Aleinu, page 11. Aleinu l'shabayach v'adon ha'kol al-atet g'nulam l'yotzer b'reshit Sh'lo ha'samu k'gwey ha'aratzot v'lo ha'samanu k'mishpachol ha'adamam Sh'lo sam ha'chalkinu k'ahem v'gohor aleinu k'chol ha'monam v'anachnu k'orim Kaka tu vitora techa, Adonai loch lila amaret, Benemar, Behaya Adonai, the Melecha Koharet, Bayomahu, Bayomahu, Ye Adonai Echad, Ushema. Ushemo, Ushemo Echad. Mourners and others observing a yurt site, I invite you to enable and enable your voices so we can say the Mourners Kaddish together, page 12. Yit Gadal, Gadash, Shemir Rabbah, Ma Divra Kirate, Yamlich Malfute, Bechayachon of Yomechon, Bechayachon of Beit Yisrael, Raga La, Lizman Karib, Bimru, Amen, Yehesh Me Raga Mavora, Alvan Me Omaya. Yiparach, Yishtabach, Ba'ar, Yitomam, 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 Yitadar, Yitare, Yitalal, Shmei, the Kudashah, Yitomam, Le'elam, Yikol, Birchata, Beshirata, Tush, Bechata, Benechamata, Sha'amiram, Be'alma, Vimru, Amen. Yehesh, Lama, Rav, Rabbi, Shemaya, Vechaim, Aleinu, Be'alko, Yisrael, Vimru, Amen. Ose Shalom, Ose Shalom, Well, Shabbat Shalom, everybody. As we are about to walk into Shabbat, I want to invite everybody to close their eyes. Um, Jordan reminded me of a saying that I, I am, am fond of using uh, at moments like this, at this time of day, where I will say, uh, I'm slamming into Shabbat. Now Jordan uh, was expressing that about his own, uh, his own day, uh, a day that started, he said, at 4.15 in the morning and then, and then goes and goes and goes and it doesn't slow down, it gets faster and faster and faster and then he slammed into Shabbat. And it's a really, uh, it's a really descriptive, very, um, very full um, image uh, that you slam into. Because of course that's, that's borrowed, uh, it's borrowed from car language, right? What we talk about when we're, talk, when we're driving. If we slam into something, it's never a good thing. It's never a good thing to slam on the brakes. It's never a good thing to slam into the person in front of you. It's never good to slam into a tree. There's really no good use of slam. Maybe slam the trunk, but that's about it. After that, it's all bad uses of that word 
um, when you're talking about driving, and that's kind of how it feels. We don't feel like we're slamming the trunk when we say that expression about Shabbat, because if we were slamming the trunk, that means we are ready to go, right? We've put everything in, it's all organized, we slam the trunk, and we get in and we're ready to enter Shabbat. It's not. We're using it in the way that it, it sounds, right? We're slamming on the brakes to make it into Shabbat. And, um, and that brings a lot of biology with it. Even as I'm talking about it, I'm feeling my, kind of my heart racing a little bit, because we've all had that, any of us who drive have had that experience. God forbid you go into the person in front of you or go into any other object. But in those cases that we are blessed, we are lucky that all it did was, was shake our car and bring us to a stop in time to, to be away from everybody and that we didn't hurt ourselves or anybody else. There's still a heart racing. There's still something really traumatic about that experience. And what I want us to, to close our eyes and think about is that when we have that, the drive afterwards is so much different than the drive coming in there. Now you'd think the drive afterwards is all about our eyes being focused and we're paying more attention now, but in truth, our view is, is really myopic. We, we're really focused on a, on a pinpoint. And that's what we want to avoid when we're coming into Shabbat. We actually want to open up our eyes. We want to open up our view. Shabbat is supposed to be a taste for the time in the, for the world to come, something that is opening us, opening up our heart, opening up our soul. That's why the tradition says we get a, a neshama yatera, a second soul, to open us up. But when we slam in the Shabbat, like Jordan talked about, like I too often do, then my view, my, my mind becomes myopic. So take a moment to keep your eyes closed and to take that breath, whatever it is, to calm your heart and truly slam the trunk on the weak. Everything's put away, even if it's not. Everything is secure, even if it's not. Because the beauty of Shabbat is that it doesn't matter. It'll all be there in 25 hours. But for now, we are entering into a sacred space. And the only way to do that is to have our eyes wide open and not myopic, not filled with anxiety or fear or frustration. And so as we take two more breaths, we enter into Shalom Aleichem on page 13 with openness, with our eyes open, seeing much more than just the view and the cars in front of us, but we open our eyes in ways to let us see beauty and depth and love. Shalom Aleichem 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 Mihim Aleich Aleichem Aleichem Akadosh Baruch Hu Boachem Shalom Aleichem Shalom Aleichem Aleichem Mihim Aleichem Aleichem Akadosh Baruch Hu Baruch Hu Nile Shalom Malachi Shalom Malachi Elyon Mi Melech Malachi Malachim Akadosh Baruch Hu Zedekem Le Shalom Malachi Shalom Malachi Elyon Mi Malachi Amelachim Akadosh Baruch As we move to page 15, Lechu Neranana, we go and we run, Lechu, we move. We move ourselves into Shabbat, into songs and praise. We do it as a community, but how are we moved and allowing ourselves to be moved? Page 15, Lechu Neranana. Lehu Niranana Ladonai Nari Aletsur Yishenu Nikad Mafana Pitodan Bismiro Nari Alo Nikad Mafana Pitodan 
is me road na riyalo
Et Yeshua Eloheinu, Ariu Ladonai, Kol Haaretz, Pitzchu Veranenu, Vizameru, Zamru Ladonai, Bechinor, Bechinor, Bechazim Rab, Bachat Sotrot, Bechol Shofar, Ariu Livnei HaMelech Adonai, Yiramayamu melo Tebel be yoshve eva Neharodim kauhaf Yachar harim yiraninu Bifne adonai kiva Vishpot haaretz Yishpot tebel betzedek Be'amim be'me'sharim Yalai la 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 yalai Yalai la la Yalai 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 la la yalai la yalai la Yalai la la yalai la yalai la Yalai la la yalai la Shem <laughs> Romemu Adonai Eloheinu, Vishtachavu lehar kodshau, Kikado Shadonai Eloheinu. I invite you to stand in body or in spirit. Page 20, Mizmor le David, Psalm 29, page 20. Mizmor le David, Hamul Adonai b'nei Elim, Havula donai, kavod vaos hai hai hai. Havula donai ke vochimo, shachavula donai behadra kodesh. Kol adonai al hamayim el hakavod hirim. Adonai Amayim Rabim Kol Adonai Pakoach Ay, ay, ay Kol Adonai Be'adar Kol Adonai Shover Arazim Vaishtaber Adonai Etal Zeha Levanon Vayarki Dehem Oegel Levanon Vesirion Kemo Kemo Ben Reimim Ay, 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 ko Kol Adonai, chotet el ha-hodesh, kol Adonai, yachil mi-bar, yachil Adonai, mi-bar ha-kadesh, kol Adonai, chol el ha-yalot, v'ayechesot, ye-arot, u-ve-chalot, kulo omer kavot, Ay, 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 Adonai, Lama Boya Shav, Yeshev Adonai, Melech Leolam, Adonai Ozli, Yama Moitain, Adonai Yevarek, Ramo Vashalom. Ay, 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 Yay, 
来来来来来来来来来来 Please be seated as we're going to stay on the bottom of page 20, Anna Bakoach, uh, as we'll sing that together. Do you know it? I'll do it with you. Oh, okay, got it. Okay. <laughs> Anna bekoach bekoach gedulat yamincha yamincha tatir terura kaberina tamcha sagvenu tarenu nora Anna bekoach bekoach. Gedulat yamincha, yamincha, tatir terura, kabel rinatamcha, sagvenu, tahareinu, nora. Yadadai, 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 Page 21. And as many of you know, tomorrow is technically the 17th of the month of Tammuz, although we won't mark it technically on Shabbat. We'll do that on Sunday, Saturday night and Sunday. Uh, and so this is a time that even though in the world, it's summer, and people are very happy and playing outside and enjoying the nice weather. It's kind of a little bit of a somber time. Uh, it's certainly the beginning of the three weeks leading up to Tisha B'Av in our calendar. Pene pene Shabbat nekabelab Shamor bezachor b'dibor echad Ishmiyanu el hamyuchad Adonai echad Shemo echad L'shem oti peret velit hilab L'chad odi likrat halab Pene Shabbat nekabelab Lechado di likra atalab, pene pene shabbat nekabelab, likra shabbat lechuven el chab, ki hi me kor habracham, me rosh mi kedem mesuchab, so ha asem shabbatilab. Lechado di likra atalab, pene shabbat nekabelab. Lechado di likra atalab, pene pene shabbat nekabelab. Mikdash melech yir meluchab, kumitze imi mitotahafechab. Rav Lachshevet b'yanek ha'bachab Ve'hu yachamol alai ayichem lab Lechad odi likra akalab Penei Shabbat nekabelab Lechad odi likra akalab Penei penei Shabbat nekabelab Hitna ari me afar kumi, lichi big day ti farte ami, al yad ben yishai me dalakmi, korba el nav shi ge alab, lechado di likra kalab, penei shabbat nekabelab, lechado di likra kalab. Pene pene Shabbat nekabelah. He tore re, he tore re. He baore kumi ori, uri uri. Shida beri. He vodanai ala yich miga. Lechado di li krat kalam. Pene Shabbat 
นิคาเบลานเนธาโดดีลีครัตคาลาเฮเนชาบัตนิคาเบลาโลเทโบชีเบโลติคาลมีมาทิสโตคาฟีอุมาเทมีปากยาคสุอันนี้เอียมีเวนิบเนตาบอิราตีลาบเลขาดดีลีกราดคาลาบเพเนชาบัตเนคาเบลาบเลขาดดีลีกราดคาลาบเพเนชาบัตเนคาเบลาบเดฮายูลินชีซาบโชซาอิกดิราฮาคูคอเมบาลาอิกยาซิซาลาอิกเอลฮาอิกกิมสุสคาตานอาคาลาบเลคาดดีลีกราดคาลาบเพเนชาบัตนิคาเบลามเลขาดดีลีครัตคาลาบเพเนชาบัตนิคาเบลามยามีนุสโมโฮทีโรซีเยตาโดนายทาริซีอาลยาดีชเป็นพาร์ตีเป็นอิสเมฆาเดนนากิลามเลขาดดีลีกราดคาลาเพเนชาบัตนคาเบลาเลขาดดีลีกราดคาลาเพเนชาบัตนิคาเบลาพิสรายส์บวีบิชาลอมอาเทเรตปาลาบกัมเบสิมคาอุทโธลาบทอเคมุเนอาม์สิกูลาบวีคาลาบบวีคาลาบเลขาดดีลีกราดคาลาบเพเนชาบัตนิคาเบลาบเลขาดดีลีกราดคาลาบเพเนชาบัตนิคาเบลาบชัลลอมชาบัต Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. May be seated as we continue on page 23, the Psalm for the Sabbath Day. Mizmor Shir Leom Hashabbat. Tell the Noah I was a man. Lishim Kol Yom Lagi Ba Doker Kastech Halo Na Kabale Lo Talei Sefer Zman. Oh, yeah, Vina, so the Roch Hashim Kamal Esev Yati to Kabbalah Eleven. Oh, it's a little bit more Roch Esev. Tzadikat Hamar Yithrach Keres Balvanon Yisgen Shetu Adonai, 
דשנים ורעננים יהיו להגיד כי אשר אדוני צורי דלו אדוני מלאה גאולה ואש, לבש אדוני עוד היא תזר, אב תיכון דבר. נכון כי זכה מאז מאותה. מי כל הדמיים, מים רבים אדירים, משפרקי ים אדיר במרום, אדוני. איתו הוא אתך, נאמנו מיד לבית חנב הקודש, אדוני, ליורך ימים. Mourners and others observing a yurt site, I invite you to rise and enable your voices so that we could support each other for the call and response to the Mourners Kaddish, middle of page 24. Yit Gadal, Yit Gadash, Shemei Rabbah, Elmad, Yomad, 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 Bagala, Vizman, Bru, Amen, Yehishme, Rabba, 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 יהי שלמה רבה מן שמיא וחיים עלינו ויעקב ישראל ויעקבו אמן. שבת שלום everybody, so glad to have you here, our rooms filled up a little more, I guess we could use the word filled up, that will work. So it's good to see you. People online you can't see it, there's like a thousand people in here, it's like unbelievable, they're just like all piled in, it's very exciting. You're all missing out, so, yeah. Um, but I'm glad everybody is here. Jordan, thank you so much. In a minute, I'm going to invite you to light candles after I say just a few words. And uh, those online, if you'd like to set up your candle space uh, for us to do candles together, that would be really beautiful. So uh, feel free to do that uh, while I'm sharing just a quick word. Uh, so I, I think often about questions that have been brought up to me in the past as, as I've you know, been a rabbi, but somebody that people have come to to ask questions, especially about liturgy. And uh, one that I keep coming back to and keep having new thoughts and new ideas about is repetition. In our prayers, one of the biggest critiques I get of this particular book is how repetitive it is, right? It's God's great, like all the time, and over and over again, and we say God's great all the time. Um, remember, our Jewish life doesn't live on the page. This is what um, kind of sparks our... Um, uh, us in the morning and in the middle of the day and in the evening, our Jewish life lives out in the world. And we are, we, we might have heard the idea of we're supposed to say a hundred blessings a day. And those blessings are all about God is great. And so after you get over the, the repetition of the page, our life out in the world is just more of it, right? Just more of acknowledging God, not just in the food we eat, but when we see a rainbow. And even there are prayers when you see somebody who's dis disfigured, there's a prayer that you say to talk about how incredible God is for the diversity God. I mean, you want to talk about a compassionate thing. Most of the time we look at somebody disfigured and we say, oh, thank God that isn't me. Um, or any variation of that um, really crappy phrase. Phrase. But um, Judaism would have us say, wow, this is what, what wonders there are. And so I was thinking about like how I would answer that today. I had answers in the past and those fade away. And so I come up with you know, new ones that I, I think about. I do a lot of thinking in my car. So when I'm driving around, I have a lot of time to talk to myself. And um, I, uh, I remembered something, uh, an encounter I had um, based on something I wrote. Uh, when, I was, uh, when I just got here, a couple of years after I got here, I, um, I wrote an article uh, that, uh, that got some, you know, that made, it, made the rounds. And it basically, uh, it was a political article. And I basically said that I feel that, well, I can't remember what I said, but I remember the, how I set it up 
is that I said that I didn't like the show, The West Wing. Anybody remember that show? Remember the show, The West Wing? I hated the show, The West Wing. Now, I hated it when I, when I was growing up and I was watching, you know, and I'd see it, so I never watched it. And I really like House of Cards. And this is when House of Cards was big, before we weren't allowed to watch House of Cards anymore. You know what I'm talking about. And, um, and I liked House of Cards I didn't like, um, West Wing. So I wrote about that. I wrote that, I, and I, I, I said that because I felt that politics and our country represented House of Cards more than it did the West Wing. And what that felt, what that meant is that in the West Wing, like everybody was like doing their best and trying to make better and everybody was optimistic. And the House of Cards is the exact opposite of what, what I just said. Everything's opposite. And it's corruption and it's you know, lies and it's murder and it's all this stuff. And, I, and so I said that. So I got, I got called, called in for a talking, talking to by one of our congregants, really one that I, I really, really, a, a man that's just so close to my heart, uh, Elliot Levitis. Now, if you know, uh, Elliot Levitis was a, uh, a representative of Georgia uh, for, for many years. And uh, he's a member of our shul and him and his, his wife. And this was many years ago. And he said, Rabbi, I need you to come to my house. You know, when someone invites me to their house, I know I'm in trouble. And so they invited me, he invited me to his house and he, he sat me down and he, he told me, Rabbi, you cannot say that. You cannot think that. And I said, well, yeah, but what about this? And he said, well, yeah, that's true, but don't, you can't say that. And, he, and I said, well, but what about this? And he said, well, yeah, that happened too, but you shouldn't say that. And I was like, yeah, but what about this? And he's all like, yeah, I know, that's right as well, but... And what he was talking about, what we eventually got down to, is that I was allowing cynicism to set in, to sink in. And that causes a, a, a necrotic nature of the soul. Oh yeah, those things were true. All my complaints were true. But they didn't make me better saying that they were true and thinking and dwelling and talking about them. And instead what they did was they made me cynical. They made it uh, that I looked at the world and just thought this is the way it is and this is what everybody deserves and this is what we get and you know, all the expressions that we always say to each other. And what he was trying to get across to me, and it took me a while to hear it, it was a long visit. <laughs> what took me a while to understand is that the things might be true but I need to see above it. I need to see beyond it. And I need to keep some, some northern star that I could look at and say, yeah, that might be true, that might have happened, but our world deserves better, we could do better. There's possibilities, there are people who could make a difference. And that's what I was led and creep in. And that's what our prayers are about. You know, people often say, well, why do we say so? Why do we say God, you know, does God really need our prayers? No, we need our prayers. We need them. We need to remember that the ocean and the birds and the wind and the waves cry out to God in joy and splendor. We need to remember that the sun and the moon orbit in their way like champions on their chariots and not become so cynical that when the sun's in our eyes, we just slap down the sun visor or put on our sunglasses and curse how hot it is. My gosh, this is what we talk about, right? This is our daily conversation about Atlanta, how hot it is. Are you kidding me? There's a ball of fire in the sky that we are spinning around at uncontrollable speeds, and somehow we all have a life in which we could complain about that ball of fire. And so it's our blessings that whether God needs them or not is, is irrelevant to me because I know that I need them. And so saying them over and over again is not laborious, it's not repetitious. It's barely enough for me to go out in the world and not think that we live in a house of cards, but instead think that we live in a place of great opportunity and love and kindness. And so we sing Kabbalah Shabbat, and we're going to sing Mariv, and tomorrow we're going to sing Shachrit. Two and a half hours. Can you believe how long that service is tomorrow morning? Two and a half hours. And you want to know something? No matter how long and boring it might feel, it's not enough. It is not enough to make us go out in the world and not curse it, but in fact, bless it. 
Let's uh, continue with our service with the lighting of candles. If you have candles, I invite you please to, uh, to get them set up and get them ready, and um, Jordan will lead us in candle lighting. Please rise. Oh, it's gonna work. There we go. Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech Haolam Asher Kiddushanu B'mitzvotav V'tivanu L'hadlik Ner Shel Shabbat Amen. Amen Shabbat Shalom uh, Take a second in your chat box uh, online to wish somebody a Shabbat Shalom that you might not have seen in a while in the room here please say uh, Shabbat Shalom to somebody you might not know or someone who's new and uh, Damone back there we won't forget you Shabbat Shalom bye bye <laughs> Uh, we're going to continue with our service, page 28, uh, in the middle of the page. You may be seated. Tamidim lo kalem le'alam barad Baruch atadonai Amari varavim Ahavat olam beit Yisrael Amcha avta Torah u mitzvot Hukim amishpatim O tanu lima de tam. Al kena donai eloheinu. Bishofeinu bekumeinu. Nasi apechu kecha. Venisma kudimre toratecha. Uve mitzvotecha. Leolam laed Ki heima chayenu Biorech yamenu Biorech yamenu Ubarem Yomama balab Yomama balaylab Yahabat chata serimen leolamihim Baruch atadonai Oh, have a more Israel. El Melech Ne'eman, page 30, the Shema. Shema Yisrael Adonai Eloheinu Adonai Echad
Adonai Eloheichem emet. Page 32. Page 32. Page 32. Um, <laughs> Malchut the Kara Ubanecha, Boke Yamik Ne Moshe, Zedi Anu the Amaru, Adonai Loch, Leola Ambahed, Mene and Marki Fadadonai Yakov, Ugalom Yakazak, Mimenu, Baruch Adonai, Gal Yisrael. Please join me on the bottom of page 32 on the right-hand side, underneath the line, uh, a, some words from uh, the great um, German philosopher Martin Buber. You cannot find redemption until you see the flaws in your own soul and try to efface them. Nor can a people be redeemed until it sees the flaws in its soul and tries to efface them. But whether it is an individual or a people, whoever shuts out the realization of their flaws is shutting out redemption. We can be redeemed only to the extent to which we see, in which we see ourselves. The world is in need of redemption, but redemption must not be expected to happen as an act of sheer grace. Our task is to make the world worthy of redemption. Our faith and our works are preparation for the ultimate redemption. Page 33, the Hashkivin. Please rise for Vishamru, page 34. Vishameru vene Israel et hashabat la son et hashabat le dorotam berit olam ay 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 beini uveimre Israel. O tiele olam ki sheyamim asadonai et hashamayim et haaretz hu bayom hashvi shavat bayina. Amidas offered in silent devotion, page 35 to 38. 35 to 38.
Shalom Rahab al Israel Amkatasim Leolam Shalom Rahab al Israel Amkatasim Leolam Ki atahu melech adon Lechol ha-shalom Ki atahu melech adon Lechol ha-shalom Shalom rahab al Yisrael amcha Tasim le-olam Shalom rahab al Yisrael amcha Tasim le-olam Beto beinecha levarech Et amecha Yisrael Bechol et bechol sha'ab Bishlomecha Shalom rahab Al Yisrael amcha Tasim le'olam Shalom Rahab al Israel Amcha Tasim Leolam Tasim Leolam <laughs> That's called a stall tactic while the grape juice is being poured here in our, <laughs> in our midst. <laughs> Page 47. Page 47. By a hulu hashamayim vehaaretz, behoats evam. By a kalalohim bayom hashvi, melakto asher asab. My by a barek Elohim at the Om Hashvi, by a Kade Shoto, Kibo Shabbat Mikol Melakto, Kibo Shabbat Mikol Melakto, Asher Barab, Asher Barab, Asher Barab, Elohim Alasot. Kiddush, page 49. Sav Rimar Nam Rabba Nam Rabba Taya Baruch Atarunaya Lohinu Melech Alam Bore Priya Gafen Baruch Atarunaya Lohinu Melech Alam Asher Kitshan Vemitzvot Taver Atzavahanu Veshavak Kodshom Yavav Ratzon In Hilanu Zikaron Lemaase Vereishit Ki Hu Yom Techilam let me cry, Kodesh. Zecher litziat mitzrayim. Ki banu vachartab. Meotanu kidashtab. Mikol hamim. Veshabad kodshechab. Biyahaba uberatzon. In a kaltanu, Baruch ata Adonai, Mekadesh HaShabbat. Amen. Page 51. Aleinu hakom, La take you la liotse er brechit, shallow a sanukigoye a ratsot, the low samanuk mishpikora adama, shallow sam chalakinu kahem, the gahora lenuk echol hamonam, vanachnu korim, umishtahabim umodim, with name elech, malcheham lachim, hakadosh parochu, 
Shehunote shamayim meyoset aretz Umosha vikaro ba shamayim imal Ushchina tuzo, ushchina tuzo Begove meromim Hu Eloheinu einod Emet malkinu et bezulato Kaka atu betorato Yarata hayom, yarata hayom Ashevota elevabdecha Ki Adonai hu Elohim Vashamayim imal Miyaretz, miyaretz, miyitachat Hey, <laughs> Bayomahu, Bayomahu, Ye Adonai Echad. Ushemo, Ushemo, Ushemo Echad. You may be seated. Uh, we continue to no uh, note the Shloshim period, 30 days after passing. For Harry Cartouz, the father to Gail Prince, uh, Dick Eisenberg, husband to Betty, father to uh, Laura Lee and Stephen, to Douglas and Lisa, brother to Bonnie and Gary Richman, and Joel Scott Reich, the son to Martin and Ralda Reich, father to Allison, brother to Craig, to Greg and Kenneth. We also note the Yurtzites um, that fall today on the 17th of Tammuz, remembering Ruth uh, Gavant, the sister to Ruth uh, Cramero. Louis Goldstein, the uncle to Ben Cavalier and Sa Sally Kaplan. Estelle Grazier, the sister to Arlene Rosenthal Gill and the niece to Joanne Rosenthal. Henry Vogel, the father to Stanley and Dina Vogel. Sarah Yablon, the sister to Rosalie and Carl Rosenthal. Edith, uh, Edith, Edith Weiner, the mother to Mark and Nancy Weiner and grand, uh, grandmother to Michael. Rose Major, the aunt of Fran uh, Galishoff to Rini Geller and to Amy Landrum. We also to continue to walk with those who come morning and evening remember, to our uh, daily service, remembering John Sherman McDade, the husband of Marcia, uh, brother-in-law to Jeannie and Bob Tepper, Demetrius Coffey, Steve Wexler, and Mike Schaefer, Walter Hirschberg, Eleanor Sims, Ralph Sachs, Kathy Baumgartner Shear, Arnold Landy, Rick Goldstein, Doris Coplin, Susan Pollock, Francis Poller, Mary Goldstein, Leon Goldstein, Steve Sandusky, Malcolm Minsk, Donald Gilner, Rosalind Davidson, Sandra Adair, Marvin Silverman, Laura Chavinsky. Marsha Nodowich, Jacob Dolaboff, Jerry Kotler, Hank Oxman, Leslie Parker, Dick, um, and David Carl Yarm, Rose Berman, Bella Hayabatsari, Lester Breen, Bruce Romer, Susan Open, Hiram Sturm, Jerry Ashkenazi, Cerise Rubin, Jewel Stone, Dale Schindler, Dorothy Eisen, Stanley Kalatkin, Claire Kirschenbaum, Baruch Ben Eliezer, Sharon Hamburger, Morris Habeth, Thelma Roberts, and Bert Gershon. If I've omitted any names, please uh, forgive me, but know that we continue to walk with you, continue to hold you during this time. As you remember your loved ones, as we support each other, uh, enabling our voices for the words of the Mornish Kaddish, page 52. Yitgadal, <laughs> <laughs> 
Shabbat Shalom, everybody. So glad to have you with us. Um, Jordan, thank you so much uh, for, uh, for your prayers this evening. It was beautiful singing with you. Uh, to Neil Yarm online for being our Zoom master. To Damone uh, Fanuni, thank you so much for keeping us online and keeping us going uh, forward. So appreciate it. Uh, tomorrow morning, remember that service I said was too long? Well, it's happening tomorrow at 9.30 in the morning. Uh, so I hope you'll join us. Uh, Torah study is down in the Cavalier Room uh, at uh, 10.30. Steve Grossman will be um, facilitating that. Both those experiences are either in person or online, so feel free to come. Uh, we have our Kiddush lunch afterwards, so I hope you'll join us for lunch as well. That's at noon. Uh, tomorrow night uh, at 8.30, uh, we have our evening service, which is only online, uh, to close Shabbat, Min Hamarev and Havdala. Uh, we'll also be inviting uh, the McDade family and the Tepper family, Bob and Jeannie Tepper and Marsha McDade. They are ending their 11 months minus a day for their uh, beloved John Sherman McDade, who passed away 11 months ago. Uh, so they're going to be concluding, sharing some words about, uh, about John, and uh, it be a time for us to all be together. Uh, they've been coming on Shabbat, and Bob is a, is a weekday regular. Uh, so it would be nice to be able to be there uh, with him. And many of us know Bob Tepper uh, from the work he does with the Hevra Kedisha. So that would be really special uh, to be able to support. That's 8.30 tomorrow night uh, online. Uh, as Jordan said, it is uh, a, a Shavas Arba Tammuz. It is the 17th day of the month of Tammuz. It's usually a fast day, but we push it off for uh, Shabbat. We don't fast on Shabbat. No, I'm um, and so that will be um, the fast day is on Sunday. Um, but that means that there's three weeks until Tisha B'Av, the, uh, the commemoration of the destruction of the temple. Uh, that'll be on August 6th and 7th, which is a Saturday night and a Sunday. And uh, we have a really interesting program on this uh, Saturday night. We'll have the chanting of Eicha. We have different congregants who are coming forward to chant that book. It's a beautiful but haunting melody. So if you've never heard it before, it's worth coming. It'll be very late. It'll be about 9.15 or, or so. We have, pro we have a... a, a, a uh, what's called a seuda mafseket, a closing meal before the fast, Tisha B'Av, that'll be happening in person uh, before and ending Shabbat and then going right into the chanting of Eicha. It'll start about 7.15, we'll be out of here by 10, um, and then you could go on your way. But the next day on Sunday, uh, we are going to be having a series of, after morning mini, we're going to have a series of learning opportunities. And again, different people have stepped up to do short 40-minute uh, classes uh, in the morning, all on the theme of Tisha B'Av, which is, it's deep, it's heavy, but uh, it's good to have those days. I mean, you can't throw parties every day. It's really important to have those moments cut out in our time um, during the year where we, we sit in contemplation and uh, heavy thoughts and process through that as a community. So that is coming up um, um, August 6th and 7th. Other than that, anything else, Jordan? No, those classes Sunday morning, is that online or is that live? They'll all be online too. You could do everything oh, online or, you know, that's our new life. Like we're all, we're all, you know, yeah. we're like a reality show. Like you could watch us all the time. It's like exciting. Uh, but it's meaningful because I think a lot of people are able to make Judaism um, practical and work for their lives. And so however you want to join us online, you want to join us in person, whatever is meaningful for you, make it happen. And we're going to conclude our service with Yigdal, page 53. Rishon we in Rashid, the Rashito, he know I don't know Lam, Vikho no Tsar, Yo Ragidu Lato, Umahu Uto, Shefan Vuato, Nitano, Elana Shesigulato, the Tifarto, Lokamisra Vel Kimbo Shahod, Navi Umabi at the Munato, Torah Metnatan Liamo. 
Al yanne mi yone man peto lo yachalipa el lo yamir dato li ola mim li zula ato so febio dea sitarenu ma bit le softa var pikama ato gomel ischet setim mi palo no ten la rosha rakerish ato yislach ketzamin mishichenu. Li tod me chake kets Yeshua to me tim ye chaye el Berov chasto Baruch adean Shem dehin la to me tim ye chaye el Berov chasto Baruch adean Shem dehin la to Shabbat shalom everybody Thanks for being with us Shabbat shalom Shabbat shalom everybody online I'll see you tomorrow Shabbat shalom Shabbat shalom. Shabbat shalom. All Thank two and a half hours. Thank I guess I really didn't sell it. Shabbat shalom. Shabbat shalom. Shabbat shalom, Marty and Deborah. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Marty. Shabbat shalom, everyone. Shabbat shalom. Thank you. Yeah.